This video is about resurfacing your sidewalk part two. Now from my last video I was getting the impression that people were thinking well you resurface your sidewalk it's as good as new and it's going to last forever. But not in Pennsylvania. Uh, what happens is the water gets in there it gets beneath the resurfacer it pops it up you usually have to go over it again the next year. It all depends on where you did it. But I'm going to show you like an old school technique too that all the old timers used to use and they would just use regular Portland now with the new age they add maybe a little glue into it and they just mix it into a paint and they paint their driveway but again I gotta tell you it's the last resort the only reason people resurface anything is because it's old and they don't want to spend the money to rip the old out and put new in it's a lot cheaper to do this, especially if it's businesses or something. They just want to keep it up. It's just a maintenance thing. So as long as you keep that in mind, it should be fine. Then I'm going to take it to a swimming pool and show you some old techniques I use with the regular Portland. Anymore, I use cement down, and then I could just paint the whole thing in one day. But if you notice, I only was doing it for friends and relatives because people ask me to do it. And I go and do it, next year they're going to call me up and say, well, I got some spots popped up. Well, that's to be expected. Anytime you do anything with resurfacing, you got to consider it temporary. So here we go. Okay, this video, I did some sidewalks. I painted them with Portland. And I just fixed a stoop. Well, today we're just going to uh, resurface these sidewalks. A little bit of old school. Here's uh, some parts that fell apart here, and I'm going to show you how I did it. First, we're going to clean the sidewalks off. Because this is Pennsylvania, if this kind of falls apart, we're going to get it up best we can, and get the wire brush. Go and clean it all off, like that. I'm using the same stuff that uh, concrete resurfacer is in the first video. So we're basically doing the same thing as we did before. Just getting it on here. Sims. That's the first coat. So now I'm just preparing the sidewalk. Wire brush it. Now for the sidewalks, this is old school. Matter of fact, we didn't even use glue in the old school. Gonna throw some glue in there. Like that, going to add some water. And I'm going to get old school Portland cement. Add it in. Make myself a paint out of it. I made this basically into a paint. Got to make sure it's wet. Just like old school whitewashing, you, you paint it with Portland. Now what used to be on here was cementol. All this is is a covering. 
making it look prettier. That's all it is. Filling in the holes. Old school whitewashing. I did a video on uh, patching up sidewalks. This basically has this in here too. So that's with the Portland and the glue mix. Now uh, remember everything in Pennsylvania is only good for a year or so. Then you got to keep doing it. So I mix up some cement all right here and fill in this crack. I'm going to paint the top of this too. in that crack put a little cement down the corner just like I did the first sidewalk thing yeah. and then just paint this with Portland too and just painted this stoop over here same techniques pulls driveways no matter what you're doing they're basically all the same so we're gonna look at the concrete here where I'm patching you can see it's all spalled. It's been here since the 70s. Right in here, you can see all these marks. And what that is right there is that concrete shot. And the surface is just ready to fall right off. So when you get in that situation, there's two things you could do. You could do like we're doing on the driveway. And uh, just patch it up. And then every year, do the same thing. When you do these driveways and these patches, you got to remember, you got to do the same thing every year. What I'm going to do is mix, I'm just going to take regular sand, one sand, and over here a bag of Portland, I'm going to take one Portland. That's what I'm mixing for patches, just like that. And just add a little water, mix it up, mix it up a little at a time. That's about the consistency that I want. Just like that. Here we got uh, spray it good with water. Put your Portland in there. Press it in. Make sure it's in there real good. want to use your hand to do the corners use your hand it don't hurt anything then you just get your sponge get your sponge or either a, a sponge float just sponge it in that's all depends on what kind of finish you want So the point I'm trying to make is once you start to resurface it, just like if you had a blacktop driveway and you have to put new blacktop coating on it every few years, the same thing with masonry. I see companies come in and they start advertising, redo driveways, and after a couple years they're gone. Uh, nothing works in this part of the country. Uh, but as long as you know you got to keep redoing it to keep it up, it's a patch, you're going to be fine. So that's the end of the video.